not so daft game craft. I've been gone, I understand. Um, what would COVID and the fact that recording usually requires me to be able to get alone for a couple of hours, unless you want to hear kids and Nickelodeon in the background. Uh, plus the fact that I've been playing a lot of uh, Breath of the Wild and I don't have a laptop to record and or edit videos through. So I just haven't been doing anything. Thank you very much. <clears throat> but a fellow by the name of Walter Mejia has been having trouble since the update and he cannot find a nether fortress. This is his world. If you would like to visit this world, uh, the seed is 77, 199, 7409. And he's got a little village in the background there. I was going to do this in creative, uh, but the honest truth is I've got maybe 15 or 20 minutes to do this before I have to leave. Um, so I'll edit it later. Um, but let's go have a look and see if we go into the nether. I've got the coordinates he's using uh, where his gate was. And we want to get pretty close to that so that we don't, um, we don't end up coming into a different part of his nether. A couple blocks won't make a difference. Let's do that. Got his gate at 4177.66, which he's, he indicated is in the village. What did we say? 41.77.66. 41. Sixty-six. This'll do. All right, let's see what's happening. Hey, man, did you check where the sun comes up? Oh, crap. <laughs> I never checked sunrise. But... Here's a block of dirt. Here's a sunflower. That is east. All right. This is a weird landing spot, man. So we know that east is to my left. And west is to my right. So we really only need to go one of those directions for some length of time. I gotta be honest, I haven't been in the nether since the update. <laughs> it's pretty trippy in here. I think I went in once. I was like, let's go see what's happening. But I really cannot get into Minecraft lately. I know it's kind of sad. Me being so good at it and all that, you know. Gosh, it looks like a cityscape. It's, it's actually pretty cool. The nether was always so boring. Wow, what is that? What a weird structure just hanging out here. It's like snowing. It's pretty cool. All right, buddy. <laughs> That's got to be disappointing. It's going to be tough to get to, but there it is. I'm never wrong. Just want you people to realize that. Okay, so now I'm heading back the direction I came. I should have checked my cords. So you got a big lava lake to cross here, but you can build a bridge by setting um, stones into the uh, lava. I'll show you real quick how that works. Let's say you make your way to here. Well, not exactly there. Here. I've got obsidian on the bar, so that's what I'm going to work with. We just creep forward, go into, oops. I, I, oh, so, we're going to go down into crouch, you go out, you drop a block, all right? Now, there will, of course, be bad guys always bugging you, so I go out a few, and then I like to lay down tunnel walls. Like so, and I'll even start 
the ceiling. Yeah, this is bad block, dude. So I just make these kind of tunnels as I go. Bang, 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 bang. Those guys are gonna attack ya. But there ain't much you can do about it. But we do know that the fortress is out there, right? There she is. So all we gotta do is go back. Our spawn point is over here somewhere and up. I would like to leave this guy able to have a look at the environment. Or it's in here somewhere. It was in here. Like we came over this way. What's that stuff? What is that? saw the lava pool we made in a brief little glitch. Sunflower looking east. So you just got to build yourself a tunnel straight east. Yeah, we'll just zip through some of this. Yep, okay, we're about to. We're about to pop out. It looks like we might even pop out where I was building that room. Oops. All right. So. Yep, so here we are. So it's pretty straightforward, man. I don't want to be a meanie, so I won't. Go on, man. But when I tell you people, you just got to go west or east. You know? I say it largely because that's exactly what you got to do. It's just keep going west or east, and you're not going to find them right away. You know? It can take some substantial exploration. Somehow we missed it. <laughs> oh, there it is. We just flew over it. All right, there you have it. Nether Fortress. Plant a sunflower. That'll tell you what direction east is. Figure out which direction the sun rises and sets. Build your nether fortress like a frame on a picture, looking at the rising sun or looking at the setting sun. Then when you go through the fortress, sorry, when you go through your nether uh, portal, you'll always be facing east or west. But the sunflower one, that's one of the coolest. Um, because then it's, it's like a no-brainer. But again, if you know where the sun sets, man, you know where west is, build the gate like a picture frame looking that direction. You'll always know which direction you're facing when you get to the nether because they stay the same. There it is, folks. Nether Fortress made easy. Nether Fortress 101. Thank you guys for watching. Sorry it's been so long. It'll probably be just as long before you hear from me again. Thank you for watching Not So Daft Gamecraft. I have been Gosub. You have been great.